Princess, and welcome to my lunchtime adventure at Ocean Key. There are several eating places, at least uh, that's what I see on the map. There are a couple of buffets and some food trucks scattered about the island. So I'm going to take a walk around, see what the, the menu looks like, and uh, then we'll <laughs> decide because it is afternoon. It's substantially afternoon, like 1230. And uh, yeah, I am uh, I'm more than peckish by now. Uh, everything's kind of spread out, so it might take me a while to hobble around, but uh, we'll, we'll do a good survey and then, uh, well, you know what, just start with what looks best and go from there. This is the sneaker, no, seeker food court, I think one of two, and uh, it's, uh, well, the lines look like they're backed up out of the facilities. I don't know, I might just take a quick peek, or I don't know. I, you know what, no, I want to check out the food trucks first, but I don't know, maybe I'll have a look. The buffet looks okay, and there is a huge, huge, and wait for it, just wait, you ready? Very slow moving line. So I'm gonna go check out, there's two food trucks here, at least they're supposed to be, and maybe one over there. I don't know, hopefully uh, that will be a much more expeditious experience. Found the first set of food trucks, uh, not open, open and most importantly no line let's go see what they got all right are we supposed to guess or is there some sort of psychic divination going on here because i'm not i'm not detecting anything okay no no nothing nothing hmm all right i don't think msc understands the concept of food trucks the menu there was uh burgers hot dogs and fries all right i'm gonna go to the next set see if we fare any better. Leaving the food trucks I was just at, I asked about uh, the location of the others and whether it was worth walking all the way to the other, not only side of the island, but uh, uh, over to the other buffet area. I think that's what it is. And I was told that uh, the one food truck over there is uh, also burgers and hot dogs. So yeah, no point in walking all the way over there. However, I was told that Continuing down this way, there is another food truck that has seafood. And, uh, well, no, nothing more specific, so we're gonna make our way this way, find it, and uh, see what the seafood is. I'm getting hungry, and this is getting a little uh, more difficult than it needs to be. All right, uh, yeah, confirmed. They definitely don't get the whole food truck thing. Uh, what genius came up with this idea, or what genius design this place without providing adequate power. A generator? Okay, this is very loud and obnoxious. Not only is it loud, but it is expensive. There is no complimentary food here. Now, I I get that, but, well, the only other option at the food truck is burgers, which are at the buffet. All right, um, I don't know. Maybe I will walk to the other uh, buffet area, but I'm kind of scared that it's going to be Whatever, whatever. Calm down, calm down. It's fine, it's fine. No, it's not fine, but just calm down. We are pretty deep into this lunch review and I haven't gotten a single thing to eat. So this mission, and it is turning out to be a hella mission and a half, not going too well so far. Uh, my only option might be the incredibly crowded and very, very slow moving buffet. I, I will get something from there because I do want to, I, well, this is an island dining review, so I got to eat on the island, but um, yeah, if I'd been here before, I'd just go back aboard the ship where I'm sure it's quite quiet and easy to get uh, food. All right, well, uh, the mission, the mission continues. Well, the line here, <laughs> just my luck, is even worse. So I asked about the boho house and what it was and uh, yes it is just another like buffet building I asked about the menu and uh, it is apparently exactly almost about the same okay um, I suppose I could come up with a more ambiguous answer if I really tried but it was you know what they they got it right on the first try so now I don't know what to do do I hobble all the way over there to find almost exactly the same menu or just wait here they're not making this easy and we head down the long winding path 
hopefully will lead us to our destination, although I'm not sure. Uh, there's no map over here, and I don't see, well, I don't see the building. It might be over that hill, but uh, yes. Uh, oh, wait, maybe that's it over there. Or is that a marina? All right, it's definitely not this way, so I'm gonna take a gamble and uh, and turn here and head uh, head that away. Wish me luck. Nope. Time for plan uh, F. All right, the figurative question would be, what kind of Mickey Mouse operation is this? Except Mickey Mouse actually runs a pretty darn good and completely functional cruise line. This looks like our only option after inquiring with somebody who apparently knew Boho House is not open yet. When I asked what yet meant, 2022. So it is clearly out for today. And the line is even, oh my God, the lines are even longer. Oh geez, this might turn out to be an ice cream review. I started a timer. Let's see how long this takes. <laughs> you know what, sometimes all you can do is laugh, especially when things have reached peak stupid. All right, this is not inside. This is an outdoor venue. Not even Disney would try and pass this off as inside, yet they require masks in this giant open air facility. Okay, and you know, the young lady was very kind about it. She says, uh, because of the food. Okay, well, then I had to point out, because when I went through just looking at the, the spread, uh, they need to stop passing the plates back and forth between the guests and the food service, because now people are touching things and that's probably worse than anything else. So if they're gonna do protocols, then like at least be consistent about it. Like I don't want other people, I don't want the crew touching plates that other people have touched and then they touch it and then touch mine. That That's, no, and on the ship they don't do that by the way. Everything, they just hand you the plate and uh, that's it. So yeah, uh, all right. I think ice cream will calm me down. We are done, but not defeated. There is still apparently one more option. Well, I hear there is another food truck by the ice cream shop. Gonna take a peek at that, although it's probably gonna be burgers and hot dogs. We'll see. And uh, then it is uh, back aboard after my otherwise rather di disappointing experience here. Uh, I don't really feel like going in the water, or, and there's actually nothing else to do here now that I I realize it, I don't know, whatever. I'm just so frustrated that I uh, just wanna relax and calm down and I don't know, think about uh, happier days in the past. They were just like uh, three weeks ago. This is a key lime ice cream with rainbow sprinkles. So I thought, yes, I did try it a little bit. I, I thought this would calm my nerves a bit, but no, no, MSNBC, they somehow found another way to give me problems. Uh, by handing me a uh, dirty spoon, or a spoon in a dirty wrapper. Um, yeah, okay, I get it, it's an ice cream shop, it, it's probably just chocolate or a coffee, but still, ew. Uh, okay, this is, yeah, I'm, I'm gonna eat this out of the cup, I haven't touched it, and, uh, well, with the dirty hand, wash my hand, and then I am back on board. At least we can end on a happy note, the key lime ice cream with rainbow sprinkles was really good. I did enjoy that, slurping it out of the cup, but uh, yeah, it did not detract from the flavor at all. Quite, quite delicious. Now I'm thinking maybe I should have gotten a medium or a large. All right, um, I think I'm just gonna maybe have a drink at the bar because uh, I'm here, why not? It's a thing to do. Then uh, retreat back to the ship and get some real food. Scratch that, uh, waited, 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 waited. Waited, waited, wanted to stop waiting. All right, back to the ship we go. And that's going to do it for my lunchtime adventure on uh, Ocean Key. Not what I expected, not what I expected at all, but I will say, honestly, the ice cream was really good. So that in a weird way, kind of made it worth it. I mean, really good key lime ice cream? Yeah, that's uh, that's gonna that's gonna make me happy 
no matter what. So despite all the other lunacy that occurred and the fact that they still need to go get something to eat now, you know what? I am still, still thankful for my problems.